Hey everybody, um, Jason here, and I'm here to do the 25 questions tag. I think that's what it's called. Anyways, I first saw it on Drew DS uh channel, and um, he didn't tag me, but I thought it was like a fun idea. And then I saw a little Balladeer do it, and um, she tagged everyone, so I thought, well, I'm part of everyone, so I just thought it'd be fun to do. And um, so it is a non-wax related question and answer kind of thing. It's, uh, I don't know, I don't know. It's just kind of fun. It's kind of like those Facebook or MySpace. Well, I guess nobody uses MySpace anymore, but um, little question and answer things. And um, so, but I think it's interesting to see people's responses and it kind of lets you get to know the person a little better. So. Um, I copy and pasted the questions and so I will just um, start in on them. The first question is do you have any pets? And yes I do. I have one Chihuahua which um, if any of you watch my videos he does make cameo appearances sometimes so um, his name is Coco and that is K-O-K-O. -O. He wants everybody to know that he spells his name with a K because he feels that it is um, the masculine spelling of Coco because people say Coco that sounds like a girl's name not if you spell it K-O-K-O -O. <laughs> and this is Coco talking he told me to tell everybody so um, and yeah I've had him about nine years so he's getting old he's kinda cranky but um, he gets nicer in his old age he knows I'm talking about him he's over there he's kinda moving around a little bit he's like I know he's talking about me um, the second question name three things that are physically close to you um, well I have my remotes I have uh, my tropical spice slatkin candle burning very close by and um, some magazines so <laughs> I'm sitting right in front of my um, coffee table so and all those things are on there um, let's see what's the weather like right now um, actually it's pretty warm um, I would say it's probably about 82 degrees and it's midnight so it's getting pretty hot <sighs> anytime it's 80 after midnight that's too hot to me do you drive if so have you crashed um, yes I do drive uh, and yes I have crashed one time no actually twice um, the first time was um, not my fault um, the lady ran a red light when I was turning left and so it was her fault nobody was hurt and there was minimal damage to both vehicles and then the second time I ran into a construction zone <laughs> it was rainy and dark and I didn't see that the lane was about to close off and I didn't change lanes and ran right into a big construction hill of dirt so <laughs> and actually I still drive that truck the same truck and I um, my bumper came off and everything and I still have it like my bumpers in the back of the um, truck still to this day and this happened a couple of years ago so anyways that's that was kind of embarrassing but it was dark and rainy don't judge so what time did you wake up this morning actually I slept pretty late I slept until probably 11 <laughs> but I work evenings and I'm kind of a night owl so I, d I go to bed late and I don't have to wake up in the morning usually so I sleep late um, when was the last time you showered uh, right before work which was about eight hours ago um, what was the last movie you saw I went and saw I don't go to the movies very often um, but my mom and I went and saw Dark Shadows um, last week or maybe yeah it was last early last week so um, and it was my first IMAX experience so it was fun um, it was a fun movie um, and let's see uh, what does your last text message say I don't have my phone near me and I am not a person that um, I, I'm not tied to my phone I'm not glued to my phone I don't care 
much about cell phones. I have one. It is a pay-as-you-go thing, and it's mostly for emergencies. I drive an older vehicle, so I like to have it for um, emergencies in case I break down or something. Um, but really, I don't, I don't enjoy talking on the phone at all. Um, I will text message a little bit, um, and that's also cheaper. So when I do use my phone, it's usually through text message. Um, so yeah, I don't remember what the last text message is because when I get home, I put it on my charger and I forget about it. Um, what's your ringtone? It's just a really basic, like a ringing ringtone. It's not a song. Um, have you ever been to a different country? No. Uh, do you like sushi? No. I don't like, I just can't get, I think I like the sauces and like the different dipping sauces. I've tried, I've tried sushi a couple of times just when people had it and they're like, no, you really ought to try this. And, um, I like the sauces, but I don't like the taste of the sushi. So no thanks. Where do you buy your groceries? Um, I shop at a local grocery store. It's called Homeland. Um, and they double coupons and it's the only grocery store that doubles coupons in the city so that's where I shop um, because I am big into couponing so and I um, go to a local coupon matchup site and they match up the sale that week sales to what has a coupon out and that's how I make my shopping list for the week if it's something I need it's on sale I have a coupon I shop there and then for the stuff that I can't get um, at Homeland I will go to you know like Walmart or um, there's another local grocery store called Best uh, Buy for Less that's where I go um, have you ever taken medication to help you fall asleep that's a random question um, uh, I think Tylenol PM or something uh, nothing prescription um, and that's only been on occasion how many siblings do you have one brother and he is um, four years or like three and a half years younger than I am um, how do you have a desk or oh, I'm sorry do you have a desktop computer or a laptop um, I have a laptop we have a desktop in the house but um, Ron uses the desktop that's his and I have a laptop that I use. Um, how old will you be turning on your next birthday? 19. Do you wear... <laughs> I can't even, I can't even uh, keep a straight face. I was going to try to keep a straight face and just go right to the next question. Um, no, I'll be 36. Do you wear contacts or glasses? Neither. Do you color your hair? No. But I'm starting to get a lot of gray and so it may be happening soon because um, I don't know that I'm ready to just go all gray I mean I'm not there yet but yeah I got I, I've been plucking the grays lately tell me something you're planning to do today well today it's midnight just after midnight so I'm going to uh, uh, assume that it's Sunday so today I am planning on sleeping and then um, I'm planning on hopefully I'll make it to church in the morning but I worked really late and so I don't know that I will and then I'll probably hopefully work out uh, or I'll make dinner work out then go to work that's pretty much my day plan for the next um, day uh, let's see when was the last time you cried now just boo-hoo sobbing cry I don't remember it's been quite a while but I tear up I can tear up pretty easily so it really I mean I can be watching a show or a movie or hear a song or you know I can tear up pretty easily so probably today <laughs> I was pro or no I think last night I was watching um, something my mom is obsessed and now it sounds really salacious but it actually was kind of nice the moms were actually good moms but they just had little issues and their daughters were concerned about them so um, you know the first half they go through and 
the daughter talks about how her mom, like one mom, liked to party too much. and So the mom's out partying, but the daughter is like 14, 15, and she's at home taking care of the younger kid. She's cooking. She's helping them with their homework. She's taking on the role of the mom, right? And the mom has no idea. She's just out dancing, partying, having fun. And then so it shows that part. And then... Um, like the daughter's like you know what mom we need therapy and the mom's like has this realization she's like oh I didn't realize how badly it was affecting my daughter and then they go to therapy they cry it out they talk it out and then in the end the mom becomes a good mom and the kids are happy again and I am tearing up so anyways <laughs> what is your perfect pizza topping really simple I like pepperoni and sometimes jalapeno if I'm feeling spicy. Which do you prefer? Hamburgers or cheeseburgers? Cheeseburgers, duh. Have you ever had an all-nighter? Sure. What is your eye color? Hazel. And the last one, can you taste the difference between Pepsi and Coke? Absolutely, Coke is just better. So, yeah. But I like Pepsi fine. I, I'm not one of those people that are like, Coke or nothing, it's got, or Pepsi or nothing. You know, I can eat, I can drink, I can even drink RC or you know Tab or something. I'm not that picky, but mostly I like iced tea, so um, I don't drink a lot of soda. So that was the 25 questions tag, and I just think it's fun. So I tag whoever wants to do it, whoever's watching and wants to do it, and I would like to see. Um, everybody's answers. So hope you all have a great night and talk to you soon. Bye.